Well, the 2022 edition of Team Teal has certainly got off to a flying start this year. In fact, they're on course to break all records for ovarian cancer research. John Sutton's one of the major contributors here in New South Wales, not just on the track, but also with fundraising. So apart from the amount of money that is raised on the track by all the lady drivers in Australasia, there's also a lot of different functions going on, also other fundraising activities. I'm going to catch up with Tian now, along with a very happy group of our new generation of training stars. Well, Tian, we're certainly off to a flying start tonight. Amanda Turnbull just taking out the opening event with Smooth Bart, so more money into the coffers. Yeah, it's, um, it's a really good cause that harness racing all across Australia and New Zealand is supporting, obviously spearheaded by Duncan McPherson after a personal experience. Um, you know, I've been fortunate enough, I trained a winner during this series, I'm hoping to drive a winner, maybe train a couple more, um, but I just think it's a really fantastic cause with so many different ways that we can contribute. Just the early stages of this particular edition of Team Teal and already the money is pouring in. It certainly is and it's so good to see, like we're proving all the time that the girls are becoming more and more dominant, we're becoming more and more successful in proving ourselves on the track, but during this particular series through February and up, right up to March through to Miracle Mile, it's so good to see the girls going that extra mile. Apart from the fundraising on the track, as I mentioned, you've been making cupcakes, and we might try and work out how many, for the past six or seven years. Yeah, so it initially started as just a really small contribution because I felt like I wasn't going to be able to drive a winner, I think around the 2016 campaign. Um, and it started really small, just a couple of batches each week, and then I had people start pre-ordering, like Lucky Lodge, they're one of my biggest supporters, um, Michelle Buckley. Jason Grimson doesn't eat sweets, but he always makes sure he donates. He's really good at supporting the kids and supporting any good cause. Obviously, my own stable, McElhinney Sutton, racing and my daughter has now decided that for each winner she drives with her mini trotting she's going to donate to the cause as well. Well I know why they're so popular because I do have one on the odd occasion in particular last week when Freddie Hastings bought me one but they are superb. Yeah no um as I said it just started off small it's quite humble but I'm, I'm really proud of what it's taken off to be I think over the last few years I've made well and truly over 2,500 cupcakes. Each year I set a goal to raise more money than the year before, yet last year I raised just over 1,500. I'd really love to get over 2,000 this year and I mean if sweets aren't for you we'll accept any donation big or small. I can tell you what, if sweets are not for you, these cupcakes are because they are superb, you can go into business. Oh, I don't know about that. Once a year pulls me up, you know, like um, between Friday night after doing everything, cooking dinner and taking care of the kids, and then Saturday morning when I, once I finish the horses, um, in my little one one shelf oven, so I get it all done and we yeah make over 108, 108 cupcakes each week. Well, Miller, your, your daughter's with us, and Miller, you're here on a winning note because you took out the first of the trot races tonight. Congratulations. Thank you. What's it like winning a race at Club and Angle? Good. Good. Now you're going to be involved in harness racing like mum and dad, of course. Dad's going pretty well. Your dad, Lee Sutton, at the moment down in Victoria, driving plenty of winners? Yeah. And you're going to follow in their footsteps? Yeah. Now, the only one you don't listen to, listen to mum and dad. Don't listen to that GMAC, will you? <laughs> no. Right. Well, congratulations on that win tonight. Hopefully there's plenty more. And as we go back... To Tian, Tian, we've got these cupcakes here tonight. I'm trying to keep a little bit off the waistline at the moment, otherwise these coats won't fit. But we've got one for all the boys and girls here tonight, so I want to put $30 towards your Thank you. donor, your cup fundraising, and no doubt we'll have more along the way. But you and Miller can now give all these very eager young boys and girls who are doing a wonderful job with the mini trotters, entertaining the crowds, and these are the stars of the future. We'll give them all a cupcake for tonight. Perfect. Thank you so much for the support. Thanks kids, here are everyone, grab a cupcake.